We've got Clemson heading to Georgia Tech, and this one is being played at the Mercedes-Benz Stadium, not at the home field of Virginia Tech. I mean, of, uh, of Georgia Tech, excuse me. Like, that, that's the crazy part about this. Like, you, you got a conference game. Do not take these games and put them over into what is effectively a neutral site. Like, that's just ridiculous. So, uh, Georgia Tech is a 2020, maybe if I can talk to in the show, at Georgia Tech is a 22-point underdog at home, total of 51. Uh, it's 8 p.m. Eastern time on Monday night on ESPN, standalone window. Going to be a good time. I Do I believe in Clemson a whole lot right now? No. But I'm still going to take them to cover this 22. Okay. Uh, changing over the coordinators I think could be very tricky. Also, I think that Dabo Sweeney does not like Jeff Collins. They had a dispute a couple of years or a few years ago, however long ago it was, that first year for Jeff Collins. I think Dabo could see this as an opportunity to maybe knock Jeff Collins out of this job, and I don't think he's going to pull off the gas. Uh, you got a healthy team this go round. They, Clemson was not healthy when this game was fourteen to eight last year in Clemson. I think full offensive line, full defense. I mean, th- these defensive ends are not going to stop Th- that defensive line is going to continue to wreak havoc on that offensive line for Georgia Tech. Uh, Georgia Tech had a bunch of guys lose or leave out of the transfer portal. I don't trust any of the ones that came in. I This is just a sad situation in Atlanta, for sure. I think Clemson could absolutely demolish them and still not be very good on offense. I, I will certainly say that. I don't think they have to be good on offense to be able to win this by more than 22. Uh, you kind of saw that last year when Clemson beat up on South Carolina. right? Once they got healthy at the end of the year, South Carolina was a pretty good, competent football team, and they beat them 30 to nothing. So in this one, I'm only giving up 22, and I have a feeling that that stadium, the Mercedes-Benz Stadium there, is going to be probably half and half Clemson Georgia Tech fans, if not more Clemson fans. Yeah, give me the Tigers here. I, I don't know that I trust the new coordinators a whole lot. I don't think I have to. I think Clemson has got a ridiculously uh, big advantage as far as the roster goes, at, at the line of scrimmage, at everything, really. So I, I will take Clemson to cover the 22 there. Thanks for listening to Winning Cures Everything. Make sure and subscribe on YouTube or your favorite podcast app, and make sure to leave a nice five-star review. You can follow Gary on Twitter, at GaryWCE. And the show is at Winning Cures. Be sure to check out the merch in our web store and share the show.